six to one Cal beats Washington State on Saturday evening to improve to four and four in Pac-12 play and take the first two games of the series. Great pitching, great offense. It started the first run of the game of the series for Washington State was the leadoff homer from Dylan Plue. It looked promising for the Cougs. First guy up goes yard over the right field fence, but that's all the offense that Washington State would get tonight. Jared Horn was on it, and so were his teammates. First, Quentin Selma oppo in the third. Bottom of the third, lefty on left. He just rides that pitch out. Fastball away, hits the ball where you're supposed to. Takes him oppo. A couple opposite field home runs by left-handed hitters. And then Andrew Vaughn, that same inning, would double. And then Max Flower, who made a couple great defensive plays, would come to the plate and get Vaughn home to make it 2-1, to one, give Cal the lead. We'll see more of Andrew Vaughn, although good luck seeing this baseball. <laughs> Just an impressive swing by the Golden Spikes winner last year. And we looked at that ball from every I, angle, and we still could not see where it came down. Two for three on the night. He had a base there. Yep, two for three. Double yeah. and a home run on the fifth. We're going to launch an investigation <laughs> as to where that ball that he launched landed. This was two batters later, Max Flower. There's the other opposite field home run I was talking about. One from Selma, one from Flower. Cal's got some power. Four home runs tonight. Put up six runs. And then how about their shortstop, Sam Wesniak? What this about the going fourth one? JT off the scoreboard and not hitting the longest home run of the day. Impressive. He's got a little pop for a little shortstop. So that was the offense. But really, I think what what Cal will carry on into the weeks ahead is the performance from Jared Horn. Yeah, this is impressive. The junior from Napa goes eight innings, gives up six hits, only strikes out two, throws 94 pitches, but he got a lot of weak fly balls, kept his defense in the game, and he was in the strike zone all night long and a great pitching performance. Just what Cal needed from Jared Horn. Career high eight innings, the longest outing for a Cal starter this season. That was fantastic after that leadoff home.